Hi everyone and uh, welcome to Legacy TV. It's me again, Edwin. So what we're gonna take a look at today is this new bad boy here, Inex Mark Three. Okay, uh, the Inex Mark Three has just been launched quite recently. I think around four or five days back. So what we're gonna do now is actually dive down to the close-ups, see what it looks like, give you some specs, see the differences between this and the old Mark Two, and what improvement it has. Okay. So I'll catch you guys in the close-ups. Hi everyone and uh, welcome back. So this is the retail box that the Inex Mark III comes in with. Nice big black box. So let's see what does it come with inside. The first thing you see when you pop up the cover of the box is they give you a rolling stick. Like the previous Mark II, this rolling stick you can use to actually uh, wrap your stainless steel mesh on it to get a proper sizing for the wig. Okay, so let's just put this aside. What else? Uh, this is your positive grip stick. This one comes in a 0.3 mm size. Here. There's another pack of grip sticks as well. This one is in 0.2 mm. So this is for the different different thickness of wires that you have. This is the it do it does come with a bag of spares as well. As you can see, it's a bag of O-rings, four O-rings, and a spare 510 positive post just in case you break yours last but not least the Inex Mark III itself let's give you some specs about the Inex Mark III the Inex Mark III is 22 millimeters in diameters the height of the Inex Mark III is 30.5 mm not including the 510 connector it does come with a white teflon drip tip it's classic inex all right so let's push all this aside let's take a look how it looks inside okay so the top cap can easily be unscrewed this is what the top cap looks like so as you can see the base is slightly changed and it is considered an upgrade right now because you can fill your juice easily as you can see the gaps you can use your dropper bottles your unicorn bottles you can even to actually just pour your juice inside the whole Inex Mark III is made from 316L surgical grade stainless steel okay so let's take a look at the top cap if you guys can see, there's a notch right here. You see there's a hole? It indicates six small holes. So whatever setting that you see from the top is what you get. An actual airflow. So in order to adjust airflow, it's quite simple. This is much better than an old Inex Mark II. You just turn the top plate. The first plate on top, you can just turn it to your desired setting the six air holes this is three air holes two air holes two air holes at the top and a single small air hole so there's a total of five different air hole settings on the Inex Mark III much much improved from the Inex Mark II. This is a six hole setting. So if you see from the top is a six hole, you get six holes. Let's open. Okay. So let's take a look at the base. The tank can be removed. The standard tank holds three ml of e-juices. As you can see 
the style of the deck is a bit like the old Inex Kato. Instead of having a, a base at the top with a negative screw, it now uses a negative nut. So you just unscrew the nut. If you can see up close, there's notches. Some grooves or notches. For you to actually pull down and secure your negative connection with this nut. Just screw it in. So nice and secure. Okay. Besides the standard 3ml stainless steel tank, it does come with other few accessories that you can purchase separately. First of all, there's a clear tank. As you can see, this is a clear tank. The clear tank holds 3ml of e-liquids as well. Uh, the advantages of a clear tank is basically you can see how much juice is left in your tank. So just screw it on back again. You see, looks really cool. Okay. But uh, just a reminder, as this tank is not made of glass, it's just a PMMA or plastic, it is not suitable for for you who use who vapes all those juice crackers or very acidic kind of juices. This is not glass. Okay? So the transparent or clear tank holds the same 3 ml of liquid as a normal stainless steel tank. You can buy this separately. Besides that, there is another option. This is the 5 ml extended tank. See? The diameter of this 5 ml extended tank is 28.5. So this will fit really well if you have all, uh, one of those custom mods or slightly bigger mods that uses 26650s batteries. Okay, it's the same. So what you need to do is just screw it on. The finishing on all this it's really really good. Screw back the top cap. Looks really really beautiful. Alright. So that's it. So I'm gonna show you guys. I've actually got a build myself. I'm using a next mark tree itself. I'm using on a Powari P3. So let's see. Just gonna open the top cap. As you can see, I've already put a build inside. Okay, uh, it's at 1.9 ohm, running at 10 watts. Uh, I built it using 200 stainless steel mesh and 30 30 gauge wires. It's just normal countdown, 4 reps. So just to show you guys, the firing is even and nice. It's very very good for flavoring. Alright, so that's it for the close-ups. Uh, what I'm going to do is put some juice on it, come up back to FaceTime and just discuss about it. Okay, I'll see you guys in a while. Hey guys, uh, welcome back. So I've gotten some juice inside the Inex Mark III. Got some Castle Reserve Cuban 1975. It's a tobacco flavor. It's vaping really, really well, as you can see. The airflow, I would say, is slightly better than the old Mark II. The overall finish is excellent. The ease of actually Changing the air, your airflow is much much better, and with the inclusion of a new twenty, uh, what do you call that, the five ml kit, along with a clear tank where you can see your juice, is much more convenient to you guys lah. But uh, as you can see, it looks really really nice. Okay, so where you can get this is from actually from our website at uh, legadgets.com. You can purchase online or you can just walk into our stores. 
we are retailing it for 760 ringgit. It's just the standard kit with the standard tank. Okay, but we do sell the 5 ml kit, the extension kit, and the clear tank uh, as uh, accessories. It's optional. You don't have to get it if you don't want it. So I think that's it. One more wave. Really nice. So I'll see you guys again next time. Bye.